Welcome back to History of Simple Things. Today's topic comes from one of our viewers, Philip Hudson. Thanks for the suggestion. You asked, why do snakes shed their skin? Imagine waking up one morning and realizing your entire body no longer fits you. Not just your clothes, but your skin itself. It's too tight, too worn, and no matter what you do, it simply can't grow with you anymore. For snakes, this isn't imagination or science fiction. It's a regular part of life. Several times a year, sometimes even more, a snake performs one of nature's most fascinating transformations. It crawls out of its own skin. This process, known as shedding or ecdysis, has fueled myths, fears, and symbolism for thousands of years. Some cultures see it as a sign of rebirth or immortality, while others view it as something eerie or unsettling. But beneath the mystery lies a very practical biological reason. Snakes don't shed their skin to look dramatic or to scare us. They do it to survive. So why exactly do snakes shed their skin? How do they do it? And what does this process tell us about their bodies and their lives? Let's explore right here on History of Simple Things. To understand why snakes shed, we first need to understand snakeskin itself. Unlike human skin, which grows continuously and flakes off in tiny, mostly invisible pieces, a snake's outer skin does not grow along with its body. Instead, it acts like a flexible but limited suit. As a snake grows, especially when it's young and growing rapidly, this outer layer becomes too tight. Imagine wearing the same jacket you had as a child. Eventually, it simply won't fit anymore. Shedding allows the snake to replace this old restrictive layer with a new one that can accommodate its increasing size. Without shedding, a snake would quite literally be trapped inside its own skin. Growth, however, is only one part of the story. Shedding also plays a crucial role in keeping snakes healthy. Over time, a snake's skin accumulates scratches, parasites, and bacteria from its environment. Tiny mites can hide between scales, and minor injuries can weaken the skin's protective function. By shedding, a snake removes this damaged outer layer and replaces it with a fresh, clean one. In many ways, it's like hitting a biological reset button. This new skin is smoother, more flexible, and better at protecting the snake from infection and dehydration. For an animal that spends much of its life slithering across rough surfaces, this renewal is essential. The shedding process itself is surprisingly complex and carefully timed. Days or even weeks before a snake actually sheds, changes begin inside its body. A new layer of skin starts forming underneath the old one, and a fluid builds up between the two layers. This fluid helps separate the old skin from the new, but it also causes some noticeable side effects. One of the most obvious is the snake's eyes turning cloudy or bluish. This happens because snakes have a transparent scale called a spectacle that covers their eyes, and this too is part of the skin that will be shed. During this phase, a snake's vision becomes blurry, making it more vulnerable and often more defensive. This is why snakes in shedding mode may hide more and avoid confrontation. When the time is right, the snake begins the physical act of shedding. It usually starts by rubbing its head against a rough surface, like a rock or a branch, to create a tear near its mouth. From there, the snake slowly crawls forward, peeling the old skin back like a sock being turned inside out. If conditions are good, especially if there is enough humidity, the skin often comes off in one long, almost perfect piece, complete with the shape of the scales and even the eye caps. Watching this process can be mesmerizing as it reveals a shiny, vibrant new snake beneath, often brighter in color than before. 
Environmental conditions play a huge role in how successful a shed will be. Humidity is particularly important. If the air is too dry, the old skin can stick to the snake's body, leading to what's called an incomplete or stuck shed. This can be dangerous, especially if pieces of skin remain around the eyes or tail, potentially causing infections or restricting blood flow. In the wild, snakes instinctively seek out moist areas or hide in damp shelters during shedding. In captivity, snake owners must carefully manage humidity levels to mimic these natural conditions and ensure a healthy shed. Shedding frequency varies widely depending on the snake's age, species, and overall health. Young snakes may shed every few weeks as they grow rapidly, while adults may only shed a few times a year. Factors like diet, temperature, and stress also influence how often shedding occurs. A well-fed, healthy snake in optimal conditions will shed more regularly and cleanly than one that is stressed or malnourished. In this way, Shedding can act as a visible indicator of a snake's well-being. Beyond biology, shedding has also shaped how humans perceive snakes. The act of emerging renewed from an old skin has made snakes powerful symbols of transformation, rebirth, and healing in many cultures. From ancient myths to modern logos in medicine and spirituality, the shedding snake represents change and renewal. Yet in real life, this process is less about symbolism and more about survival, an elegant solution evolved over millions of years. So the next time you hear about a snake shedding its skin, think beyond the eerie image. Think of it as a moment of vulnerability, renewal, and adaptation. It's a reminder that growth often requires letting go of what no longer fits, even when the process is uncomfortable. For snakes, shedding isn't just a biological necessity. It's a quiet, powerful example of nature's ability to reinvent itself, one layer at a time. Shedding may look strange or even unsettling, but it's one of the most elegant survival tools nature has created. For snakes, this process is a fresh start, allowing growth, healing, and protection all at once. It reminds us that change is not a sign of weakness, but a requirement for life to continue. In nature, nothing grows by staying the same. Sometimes, the only way forward is to leave an old layer behind and emerge renewed, stronger, and ready for what comes next. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our other bingeable channels. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.